Hi friends, I am Asmitha. Welcome to my channel. Shania is an American fashion model. She is known as the first transgender plus size model to be featured in a major fashion campaign. Neri was born and raised in the Pocono Mountains in Pennsylvania. During high school, she identified as a gay man and performed in drag. A transgender friend of her mother suggested to Neri that she might also be trans. Neri attended Keystone College in northeastern Pennsylvania and started her transition to female during her freshman year there in 2012. She says she realized during her freshman year that she was uncomfortable being around men and so binned all her male clothing, went to the Salvation Army where she bought a new wardrobe and started living as a woman full-time. Eleven years on and she says that she's done up to ten naked shoots, primarily because designers aren't willing to dress her for a shoot or book her for high-profile campaigns, and photographers don't want her to hide her body. Add being plus size onto the trans label and it's an even harder nut to crack. I'm known as a plus size model, I'm a trans advocate, and I work an executive level job, she explained. I haven't gotten where I've gotten by not being so honest. I've gotten where I've gotten by being as genuine as possible. Neri made history in 2016 as the first plus size trans model to land a major fashion campaign. I wasn't always the nicest trans woman within my own community. A lot of times I judged people who weren't passable or I judged people who didn't fit into the gender classification, she explained. I couldn't relate to how my crossdresser friend could feel comfortable in women's clothing but go out as a man. Now she says the makeup, hair, and outfits aren't what makes someone a woman. Neri started transitioning with drag which gave her an opportunity to get to know herself. She said transgender and cisgender women frequently fall into the same pitfalls of feeling that they need to change different parts of themselves in order to be more beautiful. I don't think that trans people get to see enough people who don't look perfect, she stated. We are so invested in perfect trans imagery. are burning low one for each night they shed a sweet light to remind us of days long ago Hanukkah, oh Hanukkah, come light the menorah, let's have a party, we'll all dance the horror, gather around the table we'll give you a treat so we will need to play with the lots of sweet and while we are playing the candles are burning Sweet light to remind us of days long ago. One for each night, they shed a sweet light to remind us of days long ago.
Thanks guys for watching this video.